Hello Skull, welcome. I'm working on a much longer video right now that should be out eventually. So sorry for taking so long. Uh, today I wanted to talk about a certain creator that goes by the name of Elliot Sims. Now, most of his videos are harmless and interesting fact videos, like this one where he basically says that Albert Einstein's brain is cut into 240 pieces. I think we should go into the first video. It's, like, it's kind of the reason I'm making this video, where he, a grown man, makes fun of a 10-year-old. When this girl was about 10 years old, she was hanging out with this kid from her neighborhood. In the first frame of the video, this grown man says, this kid is dumb, and then specifies he's talking to a girl who's 10. So he's probably around the age, well, it's safe to assume, He's probably around the age of 10. She said, Yeah, last year on vacation, I actually found a dinosaur fossil. It was super cool. Wait, what? <laughs> that That's impossible. Well, I mean, yeah, it's rare, but I actually found one. It's super cool. Wait, dinosaurs are real? So this grown man is calling a 10-year-old dumb for not knowing that dinosaurs exist? And I'd like to say more power to you. 10-year-olds are annoying as getting syrup all over your hands. Obviously, I'm joking. A kid. He's not though. He's not a kid. But he sure acts childish. That was a <laughs> that was a pretty epic roast. Dinosaurs are real? Yeah, Kyle, dinosaurs are real. Don't you go to school? First of all, that's weird. No, it's not. He's 10 years old. His brain is still in the early stages of developing. He's a kid. I personally to spite you, I hope that that kid becomes as or richer than the s there are slices of Albert Einstein's brain around the world. All I do is win, 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 no matter Sus. Yeah, I, I guess I never really thought about it that way. I guess he got, that kid kind of is sus, honestly. Black markets kids ran in their schools. And take notes, because this is a great business idea. Okay, remember that he said that. That's an important note, okay? Bacteria inside this school sold peanut butter and jelly sandwiches for four dollars each, which is absurd in my opinion. Yeah, I mean, that's expensive, but it's it's a school. Do you know how little school employees get paid? It's not enough, I'll tell you that. It's so unbelievably low that I would almost think it was fiction. Like dinosaurs. I wish dinosaurs were real. Well, one girl had a very good idea. She bought loaves of bread, peanut butter, and jelly, and she kept them in her locker. She then spread the word around school. If anybody wanted the PB&J, come to her, not the cafeteria. Whenever someone placed an order- I just want to point out really quickly that I'm not making fun of these kids, by the way. I'm making fun of him, because it's the only way I can cope with the amount of stress this is putting on me. So, it's so stressful that all my hair turned white. She would make the sandwich and give it to them for one dollar a sandwich. Business was absolutely booming, and kids respected her for it too. Well, the school found out about this and shut it down. The principal said the reason she can't do this anymore is because the cafeteria is someone's job and livelihood. And by her selling sandwiches from her locker, she's taking away money from the lunch ladies, which makes no sense to me at all. If you look at his social blade, it's lit- it's- he- look, just look at his social blade, it's literally like- that is absurd. Almost as absurd as dinosaurs existing. Making over a thousand times more than them. You make how much a teacher makes in a year? In a month. Just from YouTube alone. Only from YouTube. There was a kid at this high school that was super popular. And there was a girl that had a crush on him. Ooh, a grown man telling us about high school drama. Okay, we're going back to... PNG server so just because I don't like using my face very much on YouTube, so. Well, he managed to convince this girl that he was actually in love with her, and they dated for two years. Two years? That's insane if this was true. But you know what I think happened? Also, spoiler, he, he fake proposed and said it was a prank. I think he regretted dating her and got the idea to break up with her was to do a fake proposal and act like it was all a prank. For praise. Alright, that'll have to do it for this video. It was a pretty rushed video and a pretty short video, but I needed to talk about it somewhere to vent, dare I say. Sus. I know this is kind of a shorter video, but I hope you all enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in my next video where I catch a pelican with a pelican-shaped fishbowl. Bye! I cut open a snake. His name was Drake. Yeah, he lives in a lake. 
Yeah, he is ugly. Yeah, he has a pug named Pugsley. He doesn't have any friends, but that's okay. Yeah. Drake hates Rihanna because she has a piranha. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. You don't even know Drake as well as I do. He will make you ugly, just like he's ugly Pugsley. That is so crazy.